Luna Month Creations and I am back with my, uh, if I can turn it over, witch casket. <laughs> this is actually August witch casket. It came today. So today is like August 31st. It's the last day of the month. Um, so it came really late this time. They do send it out towards the middle of the month, I think, but because it's in the UK, I usually get it the last week or two of the month. So finally got it. My friend Aiden already got hers and I was like, don't tell me what's in it. <laughs> so hello and welcome y'all. If you're new to my channel, my name is Lisa and on my channel I like to do lots of witchy things including unboxings. So that's what we're going to do. All right. Yes. Now I remember the theme. So it is travel magic. Here is our pamphlet. That's always super pretty. I love their artwork. Woo! And right on top I have a little postcard. Uh, it's not a postcard, but it's our little artwork print, and it looks like we have an outdoor altar. Love it! On a tree stump. So wonderful. All right. Well, let's jump in here. I believe this is the second box that my friend Aiden got, and you're welcome, because this is the best box. I'm just saying. The best box. Magic and nature art print, and pretty much everything that they have is exclusive to their box, so I love that. Um, this magical art print depicting magic and nature was created by our in-house designer, especially for Witch Casket subscribers. Um, and that's all it says. <laughs> oh, right on top. Let me find the paperwork on it. Travel Witch Casket witchcraft pouch. <gasps> Look at this. So it's a canvas bag, um, zippered, and it's got a pentacle that says witchcraft on it. I love it. Okay, travel witchcraft pouch. Stow your small magical items safely and stylishly in our exclusive witchcraft travel pouch. Yay. Okay. Oh my God, there's so many cool things in here. All right, let me get the sticker. And then they always give us like a little magical scroll with information. So that's what I have here. If I can get it open. Eee. Okay. I'm gonna break that. I gotta break the seal on it. Okay. So we have travel magic. So I don't know if you guys can see or read any of this. On it, we've got a little bit of information about travel magic, which I totally, dang it, I shouldn't have used my, <laughs> shouldn't have used my little exacto knife because I sliced it. Um, and then it talks about talismans to do with travel magic, essential oils, crystals, botanicals. So like the talismans would be keys, bells, nails, runes, and hag stones. Essential oils are bergamot, comfrey, uh, lavender, rosemary, tea tree. Crystals are amethyst, black tourmaline, hematite, labradorite, and malachite. And botanicals are ash leaves, bladder whack, bladder rack, comfrey, feverfew, and mint. All right, scroll. This month's magical parchment tells of crystals, botanicals, oils, and talismans you can use in spells and charm bags for safe travels. This could be copied into your grimoire or simply face the page or you can hang out on the walls and stuff. Okay, <laughs> I put these in my book of shadows. All right, next we have this lovely sachet with a cute design on it. I love, love all their sachets and stuff because they always have such cute designs. Okay, so we have some crystals. It is our crystal essential. So we have a rose quartz for love, peace, and compassion. They're just little ones. Then we have a green aventurine for success, motivation, and balance. We have a black agate for banishing, cleansing, and protection. Then we have a bloodstone for energy, confidence, and courage. Very nice. So we've got little babies. And then so they give you this little card that goes with it. And I doubt it really says anything other than that. Um, yeah, no, it just says the same things that's on the card. And then we have another pouch. God, their pouches are so cute. Like, look at these designs on here. We've got like a little bat and a broom and then the big pinnacle in the middle. Mm -hmm. 
Usually um, they've got like a spell kit that comes. Yes, this is our spell kit. So we have a white candle. We've got a little bag here. It's got a little sticker with pinnacle and it feels like herbs in there. So travel safety spell. So that's apparently it's got comfrey and feverfew in here. All right, and obviously I'm not gonna read the spell. You need to subscribe. And if you wanna subscribe, I've linked it below. Again, um, this is my favorite box out of all my boxes. It's my favorite. All right. Um, travel safely spell kit. The bewitching jute pouch contains everything you need to cast a travel safety spell for you or a loved one. Um, and it just tells what I already showed you was in there. And then it has the instructions for the spell. Very nice. And Deb and Ella are the mother and daughter team that run this box. They run this box. Also, I run this channel. And if you want to see me say that, um, for the first time, you can see that in my highlights on my Instagram, me being completely goofy like I always am. So anyways, <laughs> uh, Deb, the mama, she writes all the spells. So then we have our enamel pen and it is a broomstick. Can you guys see it? I hope that it's, can you see it? Um, we're gonna put it over there. And let's see if it says anything. If I can get it off of here. Okay, well I'll do that in a minute. Besom enamel pen, traditional way to travel. Um, this magical, Wait a minute. Traditional way to travel! Exclamation point. This magical Besson pen will enhance your jackets, bags, or wall displays. It goes on my wall display, and it's gonna take me. Oh, there we go. All right. You guys can be a part of me putting a pen on here. <laughs> like you came to watch that. Okay. Actually, he needs to be turned this way. Okay, there we go. Yay! All right, next we have a rosewood pendulum. So we have a little bag. I could read the thing through there. It is a wooden pendulum. Oh, I've got space on my pendulum thing over there too. Look at how cool he is. Oh, nice. Okay, where'd it go? Rosewood Pendulum, a magical divination tool with full instructions lovingly made from rosewood, which is believed to enhance intuition and divination. And then they just have the instructions, plus I think, yeah, the little card in here also gives you a little instructions. So we will put you right here. I bought this, can you guys see it? You guys can't really see it. Um, well, I bought a little hangy thingy that specifically is for hanging pendulums. I need to put something up here too. Okay, gosh, I just don't even know what to do. Then we have our travel notes. Look at how cute this little book is. See, it says travel notes on the side. And then which casket on the back. Oh my gosh. So it's got a little notepad on the inside. How stinking cute, there's sticky notes. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I love this box so much. Okay, where is it? Travel notes. It's always convenient to have a small notebook to hand, notebook maybe on hand for writing spells, rituals, affirmations, etc. on the fly. Witch Caskets designers have put all their love and creativity into this exclusive book of travel notes. Yes, it's adorable. Oh my gosh. Okay. It's, it's like you just don't even know what to grab next. There's, there's like, there's something amazing in here. Okay. Those are um, little peanuts. All right, so then I have this black satiny sachet. Oh, it's a crystal. Oh yeah, so they said that, that all subscribers were getting um, a selenite, um, so this is an obelisque. Lovely, yay, oh it's so pretty. Love you, I'll put you over there for now. Okay, I don't know that it's gonna say anything much about selenite obelisk. Free enchanting extra. A gift from us to you, selenite is a spiritual stone of calm and peace, an excellent stone 
To clear the mind and encourage insight and good judgment, this makes them perfect for meditation. Obelisks are energy amplifiers and are used to dissipate negative energies. They can also be used like a wand to direct energy. I, I can't ever remember the uh, Harry Potter thing. Levioso oblongata. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> okay. Then we have this little pouch. <gasps> oh! Look, it's a little hand dish. I don't know, can you guys see it? I hope you can see it. It's got a pentacle in their hand, but you could put, um, where's that crystal I got from that other box? You could put a little crystal on it. It's like a little bowl. Okay. Let's see. Sculpted, sculpted hand altar dish by Summer. Isle, which castle exclusive. Use our stunning handcrafted altar dish for offerings, crystals, herbs, and other tiny magical curiosities you need to keep safe when you are working at your altar or out in the great outdoors. Very nice. Yes, this would be really lovely if you have like a goddess altar and you put like a little offering on there. Um, I'm gonna hold hands with it. <laughs> okay, last but certainly not least, OMG. I don't know what's inside this, but look at this wooden box. O-M-G. It's got um, a candle in one corner, like a spell bottle, a leaf, and then a crystal, and then a pentacle in the middle. And there's stuff in it. Okay, let me figure out how to open it, okay. Do you pull this or do you go the other way? Okay, maybe you go that way. Oh, so, okay, so I just slid this out and inside there's some goodies and it says travel altar. Your wooden altar, excuse me, your wooden travel altar contains a white tea light candle, bam. Um, white can be used for any, any spells, two mini glass bottles. So we got these little babies um, for creating spell jars or transporting magical herbs, clear quartz crystal chips. So we have a bunch of little, yeah, you guys can't see it. <laughs> There's a bunch of little baby crystal um, quartz chips. And okay, it says clear quartz can be used to power up any spell or ritual. And then we have some sandalwood incense cones for spiritual cleansing and purification. Um, can you guys kind of see? There's little compartments. Um, there you go. We can kind of see it without me dumping all the contents. But oh my gosh! And then here, this slides in there like that. Oh, I think I just made it messed up a little bit. <gasps> But how cute is that? Oh my gosh. Which casket? Okay. Let me see. Pendulum, wooden travel altar. Whether you'll be headed outdoors to practice, here, let's do this. practice your magic surrounded by nature, or you need a small portable altar to take on your travels, this enchanting wooden altar is a witch's must have. Here's what's inside, which I already told you guys everything. So, OMG, which casket I'd love you so much. Um, I will leave their link below. Again, it's around $50-ish, maybe a couple dollars over that. It seems like every month it's a little different price. Um, it's 35 euros, I believe, and then it ends up being, with shipping and everything, around $50 somewhere between 50 and 53, I've noticed, um, each month. So, love this subscription so, so much. If you guys aren't getting it and you want a subscription, this is the one. <laughs> so thank you guys for tuning in. I'm not really sure what I can say is my favorite. Um, I definitely love this altar. Um, like all the little bags are so cute. I always love her little spells. Um, this hand is adorable, the note, like everything is great. I love it all. <laughs>
but I'd love to hear what you guys think. If you wouldn't mind giving me that thumbs up and leaving me the comment, it really helps. And if you guys are not a current subscriber, I would love if you'd hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And if you're already a subscriber, thank you guys so much. I appreciate you, and until next time, have a great day. Bye. Thank you.